Hey, what's up 360 Booth family? I hope you get to see this video before your next event because uh, last weekend uh, I had two events, right? And during those two events, my Apple TV along with my phone, they kept on disconnecting. So it got to a point where I wasn't even using the external monitor. So right now, as you guys can see, I'm running a software update. So it was my bad because I took off to the event without updating the Apple TV. Another thing, guys, make sure that your Touch Picks app is also up to date. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put a picture of the latest update here on this video. On top of that, you wanna make sure that if you're using an iPhone, make sure your phone is up to date. I updated my phone this morning. And so come to think of it, both my Apple TV along with my phone were not up to date. And maybe that's the reason it wasn't communicating properly with touch picks. Now, the reason I'm not staring into the camera right now is because I'm navigating through my screen on my phone so I can show you guys what the latest software is. Now, if you guys wanna know what software you guys are on, let me go ahead and show you. I'm gonna go ahead and flip over the camera really quick here. Okay, cool. So now let's go over to, go to general for me and then go to about. It's at the very top right here. And the latest version is the 15.5 right now, okay guys? Oh, another thing that's I think it's really important. So when you guys are at events, sometimes you'll notice that, some of you guys will notice that some of the attendees have the airdrop feature, but it's not turned on to accept files from everyone. The fastest way that I get to uh, adjust this uh, during an event is if the client has their iPhone ready, go to search on here and then type in airdrop. And then scroll down and then go to airdrop here, right? Cause it pops it up right in front of the screen for you. Oh, that's airplane, not airdrop. Anyways, you'll see airdrop right here uh, on the very, in the very top make sure that it's selected to everyone okay now if they have it on receiving off or contacts only they won't be uh, showing up on your ipad when you are trying to send that file through airdrop so make sure it's turned on and says everyone if that's not working what's also worked for me in the past is make sure they power cycle they, their phone so turn off their phone for about mm, 60 seconds and then turn their phone back on and then try it again when you try it again make sure both their wi-fi and their bluetooth are turned on on their iPhone. I don't like big phones because um, because of that. Like I like the smaller phones because I can do everything just with one hand. But you want to make sure that both their Wi-Fi and Bluetooth is turned on. Another quick way to access AirDrop is hold this icon down, just like I did, and then hold this down like that, and then select everyone. That's another method you guys can use. This video is nice and short, but I feel like this video alone is going to help a lot of you guys out. Uh, please hit me with a like button. And remember guys, we're giving out a 360 photo booth and we're also starting a 360 booth global family on Facebook. The description and the bottom is gonna have links to both of those things. It's gonna have the link to not only the Facebook group, but also a link to my supplier and to the supplier that everyone's pretty much been using because I taught you guys to buy the 360 booth at wholesale price because you should budget yourselves. Because remember when you start a business, you definitely wanna budget yourself and make sure you're running as efficient as possible. I'll see you guys soon.